Jada, I love you. G.I. Jane 2, can't wait to see it, all right? <laughs> nice one, okay. I'm out here, uh-oh, Richard. <laughs> oh, wow. wow. What's up, welcome back to my channel, Jungle Force Game, and today's topic is the Will Smith and Chris Rock incident where Will Smith essentially slapped the living hell out of Chris Rock. I'm here to um, give you guys my thoughts about the situation. I don't really want this video to be too long. I'm trying to clock it between maybe five minutes, maybe 10 minutes is pushing it, but in between, maybe even less. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get started. Um, earlier, before I you know started this video, I played the, the, the snippet of the slap where Will Smith got on stage and essentially you know, slap Will, I mean, not not slap Will Smith, but slap Chris Rock for essentially making a joke about Jada Smith, his wife, right? Um, So, like I said, I'm going to try to just tell you three, three points of emphasis. So, three points, three, right, of what I initially just came to my mind when I just seen it, what I thought. Um, So, let's start, let's get started, man. Again, I'm not here to judge Will. I'm not here to judge Chris. Not here to really judge anybody. I just want to just say, like, I just want to judge the situation, you know, or just talk about the situation and just give my thoughts um, on it. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get started. So first thing first, when I initially seen it, first, I didn't even know the Oscars was this Sunday um, or last Sunday, I should say. Um, and obviously when I was scrolling through Facebook, I seen so many memes of real Smith slapping, um, Chris Rock. And when I seen it, I, if I'm really being honest with you, I thought it was fake. I still really think it's fake. Um, it's just the timing of, you know, something always happening when ratings is going down. I hear the Oscars wasn't doing, you know, haven't been doing good. A lot of people haven't been viewing the Oscars, but now Everybody know what what happened with the Oscars because of this incident. This incident, right? So I don't know. I just felt like it was a publicity stunt. I still feel like that. But if we going based off of the fact that it's actually true and Will Smith actually smacked this man, then we have to we have to call it out. Um, because I mean that's just what we do. Um, just as a society, just as you know, people, man. Um, like I might. Me personally, I have done some fucked up shit throughout my life and people call me out. At the time, I'm pissed off, I'm mad or whatnot. But at the end of the day, you got to take that criticism and you got to be able to be like, yeah, I fucked up. Let me see what I can do to resolve the issue or resolve the situation. Will Smith did not handle the situation the best. It happens, man. Um, and so that brings me to the second point, which is basically my other, my next thought. If assuming that this situation is not, you know, G rehearsed it or whatnot and it's actually true then yes will smith is 100 percent wrong now to be honest with you there's a multitude of ways that you can essentially you know dissect this situation you could say yo will smith could have talked to this man but at the end of the day jada does she plays a role in this again will smith is 100 percent wrong jada yeah she probably did her reaction is what set will smith off Will Smith was laughing at the joke originally, but then he's he, he seen Jada and got mad. So for me, that just shows that Will Smith is letting another individual have too much of his emotional space. You know, it's like she has too much control of over his emotions. Now I get it. You gotta, you know, protect your wife. You gotta protect the person that you, you know, you care about. But was this really the time to do all that? Mm, if it's assuming that is true, no, it wasn't. Like, if Plus, it's the fact that Will Smith, like, smoothly walked up there. So, it's like, I don't know. Me, personally, if, let's say, I'm, I'm with my girlfriend and somebody disrespects her, like, I'm not going to lie. I, I I would act a fool. Will Smith was, I don't know, he was, like, too calm because he low-key was laughing at the joke. Like, he was like, yo, it's funny that he seen his wife and now all of a sudden he's very, very upset. You know, and personally speaking, I would hope that my wife, will just be like, nah, calm down, you know, chill out. It's not that serious. So, I don't know. Maybe Jada and Will need to have a discussion and just, you know, talk about like, hey, you know, I don't know. I feel like Jada needs to apologize to Will. And Will, obviously, I heard recently he did send out a uh, apology to Chris and everybody who was involved. But I don't know. I think Will needs to face-to-face -face apologize to Chris Rock. 
and, you know, just move on for the situation. Thirdly, Chris Rock handled this situation perfectly, man. Like, he took it like a G, bro. He took it. He took that slap. Like, this is what made me think the slap wasn't real <laughs> because of how well Chris Rock took that slap. Now, again, assuming that is real, I'm sure Chris Rock was pissed off, mad as hell. But again, he became the bigger man and he just kept the show pushing. Also, Chris Rock is not pressing charges. So this brings me to my final point in all of this. At the end of the day, yes, what Will Smith did was wrong. Yes, he deserves some type of consequence. But if the person that he wronged is willing to forgive the situation, then why is everybody talking about this situation? At the end of the day, all like yes, it's a slap. He assaulted a man, but he didn't kill a man. He didn't bleed. He didn't bloody up the man. He didn't continue to beat on the man. At the end of the day, this situation should blow over. I is I do I believe Will Smith is gonna lose everything? No. Do I believe that Will Smith should get his award taken away? That's debatable. At the end of the day. These two, let these two men handle their situation the way they want to handle handle it. Chris Rock is willing to just accept like, hey, you slapped me, bro. But you know what? No hard feelings. It is what it is. The rest of us should also do the same because to be honest, we have so much more bigger problems, bigger issues in today's society than to worry about two celebrities who got millions upon millions of dollars having some type of beef with each other, if that makes sense. So with that being said, I probably would never talk about this situation ever again in my channel. It's when situations like this occur, I I, I really think about, should, do I really want to post it or do I just want to shed light? And for me, this is just about shedding light to, to the community, to those who rock with my channel, rock with me. And to just to say, hey man, let's just focus on something bigger. And with that being said, thank you guys for staying tuned. I told you I was going to keep it short and peace.